propelling my passion What's going on? My passion propellers Oh man mm. Who's that right there? Oh, she, she's super right for the aunt now. Let me go ahead and fix my eyebrows. Yeah, she ain't ready for aunt now. I'm about to holler at her. Get my pump right, posture straight, attract the scalpel. Let's go now. Hey, girl. Hey, you on time? Yeah, talk to me. Hey, hey. So you, you must have scored super high on the ASVAB test, huh? Yeah, to join the service, the ASVAB test. You had to score high. Cause uh, to qualify for the MOS called my heart, <laughs> you had to score high, girl. What's your name? My name, uh, let me holler at you. <laughs> yeah, I'm score high on the ASVAB, so what? <laughs> Not a chance. Aww. What's going on? My passion propellers, man. All right, check this out. Approach. To come near or near to someone or something in distance and time to speak to. You see, some would say that Unk's approach at the beginning of the video to the young Jamaican woman wasn't a good one. Maybe it was his tone, look, style, or just not the season for him. Whatever it was, OG Unk was told- Not a chance. Does that mean he failed though? I say no. See, we fail the moment we're afraid to take a chance enough to possibly fail or succeed. The odds of success probability changes the moment we decide to take chances and make a decision. We have to be confident and certain in the way we approach life. Sometimes life circumstances reject us for reasons that only God knows, but the key is persistence. Not everyone is gonna like your style, but for everyone, there is a circumstance and destiny that we were all tailor-made for. Now, I'm not saying keep approaching the person that has rejected you, <laughs> not at all. But I am saying, symbolically, don't accept that small voice of doubt that may creep into your mind and tell you that you don't stand a chance at that goal that you put on the back burner for too long. It's time to stop putting it off, family. As we close out the halfway mark of what has been one of the most interesting years in known history around the world, there is still more than enough time to commit to the vision you set for yourself. See, in the Bible it says, write it out in big block letters so that it can be read on the run. This vision, message, is a witness pointing to what's coming. It aches for the coming. It can hardly wait, and it doesn't lie. If it seems slow in coming, wait. It's on its way. It will come right on time. See, just like a woman bears through labor pains during pregnancy, before she gives birth, we also must endure the pain of laboring towards our dreams, wants, and desires until we finally birth the baby of true purpose and existence. Let's propel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and propel in your passion, man. I love y'all. Be easy. Peace. Oh,